If you have watched this video before, then you will know what Andrax is, and how you can install, and operate it on your desktop computer. If you have not yet watched this video before, click the i button to watch this video now. In this video, we are going to install Andrax on my rooted Android device and discuss its features. If you do not know how to root your Android phone, then you must watch this video by clicking the i button. Before we proceed further, make sure you already have subscribed to my YouTube channel, if not yet to then click the subscribe button now. And also press the bell icon to stay connected when I upload a new video. And one more important thing for all, you can find each of my topics from my blog, visit now, the link is in my description. First of all, we have to check, if your Android phone is already rooted or not, and also we will check, if the BusyBox exists or not with the help of root checker let me install the root checker here click on verify root as you can see my phone is already have rooted let me check the busy box busy box also has no issue if you find any installation issues then use busy box android From here you have to install BusyBox to the system xbin path. Once the install complete, then you find that your error fixed. Now the next step is to download the Andrax mobile. Open your browser and search for Andrax, and visit the official site. Once you are in, scroll down, and click on Download Now button. From here scroll down and click on Andrax mobile. You can find the downloaded file in your download directory. Now we have to extract this zip file using an RAR extractor. Now check the box and click on Extract. It will take 5 minutes or more. Now, you can find out a new directory inside your download folder. Open the folder. Here you can find out 3 files. One is the Andrax Core, the second one is the Andrax app, and the third one is an instruction manual in form of text. If you click on the txt file you see the instruction. Now install the Andrax APK file. Here you can see, the app is installed. But Andrax is not yet fully installed, so you have to move the core file to the download folder of your internal storage. Remember one thing Andrax takes a huge amount of space which will be 22 gigabytes or more to complete the installation. So use an SD card and modify it to internal. Now go to the application menu and click on Andrax Hackers Platform. Now grant super user permission to get started. Now press OK to install Andrax. Now the extracting and installing started. It may take one hour or more. For me, it takes me three hours to complete the installation. After completion, you can find out all applications by clicking the navigation button. Andrax comes pre-installed with a terminal which they call Dragon Terminal. Using this terminal you can launch any Andrax tools. You can find lots more tools from your application menu. Let me launch one of them. Here you see the manual of how to use this tool. Similar to the Andrax Desktop Edition, you can remotely access Andrax through VNC and SSH. To start graphical interface on Andrax, just run the sudo service VNC start command on the shell. Now set your password. Now Andrax VNC server is started, and the graphical interface is fully operational. You can access the graphical interface using any VNC client on your Android, or on your PC if you want it. Let me install the VNC viewer.
Tap on the plus icon to create a direct connection. Now here add the IP address, which is our local IP address. The port is 5901. Now give your password to get into the graphical interface. As here you can see the graphical interface of Andrax. Andrax has the open SSH by default, everything to use as pre-configured. To enable SSH server, you only need to type sudo service SSH start. Remember, SSH server will be started and accessible by port 22 on Andrax IP. Now you need an SSH client. If you want to get an SSH connection from Windows you need PuTTY. Here put your IP address, if you do not know your IP you have run ifconfig command. As here you can see the Andrax terminal session. Now it's your time to install Andrax on your Android phone. If you have any doubts and queries on this video then you can ask me in the comments section or you can ask me on my Instagram.